A Twin Cities man has written a fascinating educational book about gay history in America. The book is called Our Gay History in 50 States. He breaks down what happened in each state regarding issues like gay pride, marriage equality, and then telling the stories of the significant people, places, and events that helped make history in those states. Yeah, we're happy to have Zaylor Stout here, the author of this book, joining us now. Thanks so much for coming in today. Of course, thank you. So this is a uh, this is fantastic. I mean, what an encyclopedia <laughs> for this. Uh, why were you? Why did you decide to take on this project? You know, I was actually on a road trip across country from mm -hmm. California to Minnesota, and um, it was during the marriage equality debate. Mm -hmm. So, you know, it was in the courts in California. Mm -hmm. Minnesota hadn't yet voted on it. And um, as I crossed each state line, I thought to myself, well, what relevance does this state have to LGBT history? Mm -hmm. uh, once I got to Wyoming, I thought about Matthew Shepard yeah. and uh, wanted to lay flowers where he was chained up to that fence and left for dead. And that wasn't information that was readily available. Mm -hmm. And so I thought, well, there should be a road trip guide for mm -hmm. LGBT folks. And huh. then mm -hmm. fast forward a bunch of years, I met Matthew Shepard's parents at the Quorum National uh, Coming Out Day luncheon here and thought, you know, this family is going through the worst day of their lives every single day for 19 years then. Mm -hmm. And um, I wanted to do more. So within two weeks, I met with the publisher. Wow. Two months, I was writing the book. Two years later, October 2019, the book's out. There it wow. is. I mean, it is uh, a state history. Yes. Really, because uh, that's how the laws were changed. Mm -hmm. That's how the debate was framed. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's so unusual to see that approach taken. I think mm -hmm. a lot of us have this idea that all the change happens at Congress at the federal level. Mm -hmm. But it really was the states leading the way here, don't you think? Absolutely, mm -hmm. and and Minnesota has... We for ha absolutely. We're like one of the ones who so we're the first state to provide protections for people not only that are gay and lesbian, but also based on gender identity. What so, stood out to you about the Minnesota uh, experience as you researched this book? You know, we have a real... We've been on the forefront in regards to that. I mean, you would Since think the about 70s, right? you would think the California and New York were on the mm -hmm. forefront in regards yeah. to that. But from a state perspective, you know, Minnesota was the one that was leading the way. The first gay marriage here. Yeah. I mean, it, this was a, this was a big deal. I'm interested in how you did all this research. This is a lot of research when you're talking about 50 states. It was a lot of research. Um, I actually um, hired an army of LGBT youth to help do the research wow, from across cool. the country. So it was really a community effort. Mm -hmm. So they helped dig out that information and then. Um, and then I went through and with my lens of equity and inclusion to make sure that a full diversity of, of stories were going to be shared and not just your usual suspects, but right. those unsung heroes and mm -hmm. sheroes as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because it is people who, who uh, drove the change, really. And we saw that here, I think, when you saw the shift from the campaign yeah. uh, being about like doing the right thing and uh, more abstract ideas of equity to meet your neighbor. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. They're gay. They're in love. Mm -hmm. Now Ch what? Changing. It was a fascinating lives. campaign, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, Absolutely. it's very different mm -hmm. here. Mm -hmm. Talk to us. Some of the percentages of this book sales will go to various nonprofits. Tell yes. us about that. Yeah, so 10% of the book sales, if you purchase it on the website, um, www.gay50states.com, mm -hmm. um, are going to LGBT nonprofits. And so there's actually another campaign as well um, with uh, corporations sponsoring the book. Mm -hmm. So Best Buy is actually the first corporation to sponsor the book for the state of Minnesota. So they're purchasing 175 books that will be donated to youth-focused LGBT nonprofits here in the state. Cool. So Powerful. getting the book into the hands of people that are actually going to be able to benefit from it. Yeah. That's great. Point, That's important great. to know your own history as well for the young mm -hmm. LGBT right. Q community. Absolutely, yeah. absolutely. Great oh, stuff. Right. Laura, it's so nice to have the you The book today. is called Our Gay History in 50 States. Yeah. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you.